Someday, I think I'll make it look like this isn't a bed sheet behind me, <laughs> but that day is not today. Oh no. Hello! So some of you may have seen the transformation that I did two years ago, I think, where I transformed myself into the guy version of myself. And I had a ton of fun. I look naked. The reason I love cosplay and the reason I love doing makeup transformations is just to see how much you can transform your face because humans are weird. Just a little bit of makeup and some wigs and some costumes can completely transform you and I find that very fascinating. <laughs> after doing that transformation and almost immediately after, I felt like I looked like Eric Matthews and I have always thought that Eric Matthews looked a lot like my brother. So it's always been on my list to transform myself into the man, the myth, the legend. And Eric Matthews is one of my favorite fictional characters ever. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Not my typical vintage content, but technically the 90s is vintage now, so. It's the best part. If you've never put a wig cap or a bald cap on yourself, I highly recommend it because it is an experience everyone should have. Now that I'm an egghead, it's time to don the wardrobe, courtesy of my husband's closet. Oh yeah, getting real 90s up in here. <laughs> now, my friends, <laughs> I don't think you're ready. I've also spent the morning watching compilations of the best of Eric Matthews, so my method acting is ready. <laughs> wow. So it's not perfect. I think I look more like Jack Dawson than I do Eric Matthews, but so I kind of look like a mom who wants to speak to the manager. That's shiny. Wow. You know, it was a cheap wig, so. All right, we're just gonna leave it the way it is for now and then finesse it later. Okay? Okay. So first off, concealer. Just to give myself a base, um, this is very pasty. I'm not gonna bother with trying to make my skin tone match his because it's not gonna make that big of a difference. You know, the best thing about doing boy transformations is I don't have to worry about mascara or lashes or anything like that. It's so easy. So now I think we'll do some contouring. I think the eyebrows are really gonna pull it together, so I kinda wanna save that. Nice. So I kinda wanna save that for a couple more steps. So I feel like I already kind of have similar facial features that he does, so we're not gonna go too hard on the contouring. So for this, I'm using this NYX Cream Contour Palette, which is very dirty. Now I just look dirty, but I, I promise I'm gonna fix it. He has a very defined brow bone. I think. So I'm taking NYX's Epic Ink Eyeliner in brown. I also have a very teeny tiny little paintbrush. It still has paint dried on it, but that's okay. <laughs> I'm gonna save that for the end when I want to just do tiny individual little hairs. Very archy eyebrows, wow. And then 
then with this, I'm also going to add some double. Adam's apple. I think part of the problem is that I'm very pale. So all of this looks very dirty on me. So I think I'm just gonna try to use some bronzer and just make myself a normal skin tone. Oh no, Eric's got a sunburn. Get rid of these womanly lips. So that's just kind of to even it out, and then I'm gonna go in with a more pink because men's lips are still pink. Now I'm gonna go in with NYX's Wonder Pencil and add some highlights in. I think this is just meant for the lips, but... Shh. Look, I made myself too hunky. I'm gonna lighten up under my eyelids a bit, because I think I made them too hunky. This is frightening. Oh God, what have I done? Are my eyebrows archy enough? Eric Matthews, good looking detective. <laughs> when there's a crime out there, he's gonna comb his hair cause he's the good looking guy. Zine! <laughs> Oh, that was a new one. So that was this. Eric Matthews. So I think, aside from the wig being atrocious, it's not bad. Look at that shine. Wow. So I hope that you guys like this. I know it's a little bit different than what I usually do. Just a little bit. But I had lots of fun, so yeah. I always like making these videos. I know they don't usually do as well as other ones, but sometimes you just gotta turn yourself into a 90s sitcom character. That's how life works. Cat? Oh, you don't come out for any of my other videos, but when I'm dressed as a man, I'm gonna go send selfies to everyone that I know. I love you all, whether you're new or old to this channel, and I will see you in the next video. See ya. <laughs> Hello, good sir. Oh, thank you. That's comfortable. This boy meets world. Boy meets world. Oh. Am I Eric Matthews yet? Oh God. Okay. I'm gonna add some details to the bottom of my eyelids. Bam, 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 bam. Fine. Fine. Ah. <laughs> Who's that? Is that Mama? Where'd Mama go? Where's Mama? The curtains are on fire, the curtains are on fire. They're chopping down the dorm room, they're chopping down the dorm room. Oh, Eric. Oh, me. <laughs> Look at those little toe beans. Am I right? Yeah. Pretty good toe beans, huh? Fine! Fi hi hi God. Help. Send help. Hey, Rachel, you're a full time YouTuber now. What's your next move? Fi hi 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 what new horizons can we look now? Where are tomorrow's opportunities?